my grandson was murdered, and a very intense thing that happened to our family. Uh, I was very uh, upset about Bruce truly because I raised him as a son in my home. After everything was cleared at the hospital that he was brain dead and that uh, he would not make it, uh, we decided to you know, let them go ahead on and let him go in peace. And he was a laid back kid. He kept peace in our family. And I just like them to know that they, whoever got uh, Oregon or anything from him, that they got something from a magnificent person and that he was a, he was a good person. Loved popcorn, loved it to death. So if you crave popcorn now, that's why. <laughs> And uh, he just had, a, he was just a good person, and I like them to know that about him. And I'm also grateful for you all that whoever got a part of him, that they are now doing very well and adjusted in life and everything. And it's a passion of mine now for organ donation and tissue, and I, I'm just, just happy for you, for them, for the recipients, and uh, hope that they're, you know, really, I'm glad and happy that Bruce was there at the right time to do for them, you know, because as I said, Bruce was a very clean person, never drank, never smoked, never did drugs, and that's why we was able to give everything, you know, we did.